week's Pause and Panther News. We're your hosts, Riley Johnson and Zoe Johnson. At Porter Elementary, we inspire excellence, foster leadership, and cultivate service. Now let's take a look at what exciting things we have going on at Porter Elementary this week. First up, we have sports with our Sports Center reporter. Over to you, Eli. Thank you, Riley. I'm Eli, your Sports Center reporter. In the NHL this week, the Golden Knights were defeated by the Minnesota Wild 5 to 3. Both teams would score in the first quarter and go into the second quarter tied 2-2. Two to two. In the third quarter, the Minnesota Wild would seal the game by scoring two more goals and increasing their lead to take the win. Matt Boldy would score a goal and his teammate, Joel Erickson, would have scored two goals. Congratulations, Minnesota. In other news, the Super Bowl was a close match. The Kansas City Chiefs would score the go-ahead OT touchdown to McCole Hartman, my home throw for 333 yards, a touchdown, and an interception. Brock Purdy for the 49ers would throw for 255 yards and a touchdown. The Chiefs have also won back-to-back -back Super Bowls, showing their powerful and talented team. The Chiefs would win 25-22. to And that is your sports for this week. I'm Eli Loney from the Sports Center, signing off. I knew the Chiefs were going to win with Taylor's support, but now let's see how the weather will be with Brody. Thanks, Riley. Hello, everyone. I'm Brody, here with your weekly weather forecast. Today, we'll have sunshine to start, then a few afternoon clouds, uh, with high of 49 degrees, winds northwest at 5 to 10 miles an hour. And for tonight, it will be mostly clear, low around 35 degrees, winds light and variable. <laughs> and for tomorrow, we'll have sunshine and clouds mixed, high around 55, with winds being light. And for Wednesday night, it'll be just partly cloudy. We'll have a low 37, and still winds will be light. Thursday, Thursday, it'll be partly cloudy, high near 60, and winds southwest at 10 to 15 miles an hour. That's pretty fast. Thursday night, we'll have partly cloudy skies, low around 35, winds northwest at 5 to 10 miles an hour. And for Friday, uh, we'll have mostly cloudy skies, high 49 with winds being light. And for Friday night, we'll actually finally get some rain. Uh, we'll have light rain early, then remaining cloudy with showers late. Low of 31, high winds, not high winds, but winds northwest at 5 to 10 miles an hour. The chance of rain being 60%. So I'm meteorologist Brody Hall and signing off. Thanks, Brody. Now let's talk about Habit 5. Seek first to understand, then to be understood. By the way, what does that mean? It means I listen to other people's ideas and feelings and try to see things from their viewpoints. Like when I'm listening without interrupting them? Yes, that's it. Now let's switch gears and take a look at our house points this week. Actually, we'll look at that next week. Due to a lot of sickness, we had a lot of low percentages. Happy Valentine's Day! Tomorrow our students K through 4th grade will be celebrating by throwing their parties. And we would also like to wish a happy birthday to our secretary, Tyla Hamilton. Happy birthday! Now it's your entertainment. Take it away, Brett! <laughs> and now let's wrap it up with a little joke to make you laugh. What did the shovel say to the rose? I dig you. As always, remember laughter is the best medicine so keep those smiles on. Good one, Brad. Thank you for returning to the Positive Panther News this week. We hope you have a fantastic week ahead, and we'll see you next time with more fantastic and exciting updates about Porter Elementary. All I say, Positive Panthers, goodbye. Can't wait to see you next time.